Hello everyone, I am Charlie Matthews, and yeah, um, just to warn you before this video starts, yeah, this is going to be scary, just like the Elisa Lamb video. You can go check that out on my Paranormal Animal playlist, it's on the playlists tab or whatever on my YouTube channel, my, uh, my homepage my youtube channel so don't forget to go check that out but anyway um yeah this is um this is a, this is quite a creepy and scary video so about five to six year olds and under should not be watching this unless you've like watched horror movies when you were free which your parents are probably being really bad parents but anyway uh yeah anyway enjoy and it is pretty scary you have been warned don't tell me I didn't order. Hello everyone, I am Charlie Matthews and welcome back to another video. Today we are talking about um, the, the, the secret catacombs video, well it isn't secret anymore, that has been found in the catacombs. I don't know which catacomb. Uh, you can get more in, in you know, detail on documentaries. I don't know if there's any on YouTube, but there are clips I've watched. But anyway, so I'm going to show you the Catacombs video. Apparently, it is a video of a man that apparently gets lost in the Catacombs and then loses his camera, which then goes a couple of years later to people finding the surveillance footage. No, 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 the VHS footage or none of the video footage and then they probably just put it into a VHS tape and then you know blah 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 just to put it on and everything um but yeah so uh, the footage I have here is not the original video it's actually footage from a documentary of the video because I'm sorry I literally I searched everywhere and could not find the footage so here it is Sorry, it's it's got a little clip of a documentary, but most of it's the video, so here it is. So, there was the footage, guys. So, what are my thoughts on this? Well, I bet your thoughts are real, real. Come on, Charlie, it's real. They found a VHS tape. Yeah, it's real. <laughs> well, it could have been faked easily. You see, they could have, like, easily, you know, just done a bunch of things, just ran around, looked at everything, and you know what I mean, and do all of that, you know, it's like, oh, let's just pretend, and then they could have easily just left it there for people to find, and then just easily got out, but to be fair, the true one is the most obvious, and I actually believe it is, well, I can't tell you right now because I accidentally did on the last paranormal video. But, yeah, I can't tell you my, my like, answer yet to, uh, on my opinions. But first, let's have some proof that it's real. Here it is. 
So, there was the footage, guys. So, what are my thoughts on this? Well, I bet your thoughts are real, real. Come on, Charlie, it's real. They found a VHS tape. Yeah, it's real. <laughs> well, it could have been faked easily. You see, they could have, like, easily, you know, just done a bunch of things, just ran around, looked at everything, and you know what I mean, and do all of that, you know, it's like, oh, let's just pretend. And then they could have easily just left it there for people to find and then just easily got out. But to be fair, the true one is the most obvious, and I actually believe it is, well, I can't tell you right now because I accidentally did on the last paranormal video. But, yeah, I can't tell you my, my like, answer yet to, uh, on my opinions. But first, let's have some proof that it's real. Here it is. So, um, here is the uh, evidence that it could be true. Well, real. So... Well, I think this is, again, like the Elisa Lam one, this is the most strong theory. Usually real is the most strong theory with these paranormal things, but you never really know, so here's some proof. So, as you know, it did look like, you know, you know what I mean, uh, an actual catacomb video. What I think is that this is actually a catacomb. And this, this, this man, well, he could be, he could be trapped in there. Which he probably is, to be fair, I don't really know. But, yeah, so the, the proof to this being real is that he does start to panic near the end. As you can see now, he's running everywhere and his camera's starting to malfunction. And he now realises that he's lost. So, and then, actually, at the end of the footage, he does actually drop the camera. So, that is evidence that this could be real. Um, so, now, we've got the proof that it could be fake. Now, like I said earlier, in, I think, the second scene, this could have easily been fake. Like, they, uh, they, they could have actually gone into a real catacomb and, you know, just pretended and then just left the camera there and ran. But, really, to be fair... The, the, as I said earlier as well, that the real is the most famous one here and is the strongest, as you know, uh, and a lot of people do believe that. So there's not that much proof that it is fake. I mean, like, it's actually appeared in a lot of documentaries, but as I've seen before, um, and so, um, uh, yeah, so I do... Like, I don't really know. Maybe, maybe it's fake. There, as I said, there's not that much evidence, so... I bet this is probably not the likely answer to this. So, here is our conclusion. So, um, what do I think of this? Now, you've all been wanting this answer. Well, I declare this a real... Now, obviously, I'm pretty sure you thought I was going to say that because there's a lot, and I mean probably quite a lot of evidence that this is real. So, yeah, I don't really have an official answer. But if this is fake, then I would like someone to contact the person who made the video and how they made it look like someone was actually stuck in the catacombs. But anyway, thank you for watching, everyone. I am Charlie Matthews. And don't forget to subscribe to Charlie Matthews' channel for more paranormal videos like this and other really fun Hello Neighbor and other really creepy things and bendy and kid-friendly things videos. But anyway, thank you for watching, everyone. And I will see you next time.